Hey YouTube, it's Jen. And Brad. And we are a day late for our week 53 post-op lap band update. And as always, let's start with the numbers. Why are you laughing at me? It's funny. Um, okay, remember, it's Christmas week, hence the game. Um, last week I was 178.2, this week I was 180.6 for a gain of... Did the math come in? 2.4. 2.4, yep. And I ate, I ate it. And you? And you're 5 foot 4. I'm 5 foot 4. God, I'm losing my mind. I'm 5 foot 4, and that's a total weight loss of. 81.4. 81.4. So I'm 6 feet tall. And he's obviously started, much more with it. <laughs> started at 320. Last week I was 216.8. Um, this week I was 218. So a gain of 1.2 for a total loss of 102. Yeah, you can see we're a day late and we still don't have our stuff together. Um, let's see, let's talk about the week. Yes. So we have been eating a lot. I think it has to do with we're on vacation and we're not really... On vacation, meaning just from work. We're not yes, anywhere. Yes. We take the last... We take... We, the last day of work was Friday, and we have two weeks off. And when you mix in family occasions and eating, and I think... Lack, lack just, of structure in the day. Yeah. Ah! Sorry. I just got bit by my cat. <laughs> Sorry. I, I definitely found when I'm busy at work, there's less thinking about food. Um, but also I think we almost ate our body weight in chocolate the other day. In chocolate? We tried. Which chocolate? With all the chocolate gifts and all that crap. I mean, they're giving away. I ate my body weight in carbs. We had yeah. last night, um, crackers and dip. And I just love my carbs. I love my carbs. Um, and my lap band has been very, very finicky. Yeah, because I don't know if... Okay, so last week I think I told you I had one PB... And I learned that I can, I think I didn't know if it was because of exercise or because I ate right after exercising or if it was the egg roll. And so I tried an egg roll again a few days later. It was definitely the egg roll. Um, and then the next day I got stuck on um, leftover Chinese food. So I got t stuck two days in a row and then my van said, you ain't eating. And it it basically cut off the food supply and I was basically on cream of wheat and um, protein shakes and hot chocolate. And that's when I discovered Wawa. If you guys live in a state that have the gas station Wawa with their ridiculous 59 cent any size coffees and hot chocolates and then try their hot chocolates, I think I that's what I ate my body weight in was in hot chocolates. I, I did it twice one day. So, yeah. yeah, every day it's delicious. And when you couldn't get anything else down and hot chocolate makes you feel better, yeah, a little bit bad. But. What is the one good thing that we're trying to do at least? But, and that's where I was going to, the one good thing that I'm trying to institute for our vacation is to work out every single day. Um, and I want him to jog with me every day. So I want to jog every day with him plus um i'm not going to go to crossfit because it's all the way across town um it's near where i work and i don't feel like driving in rush hour traffic to get there but i am still going to do my body combat but i also want to jog with him every day and my nsv and this is a big one yesterday we went jogging yesterday was christmas we got on the scale wednesday for our weigh-in and had been retaining so much water i'm like brad we need to get our ass out jogging before we start our Christmas festivities. And so I normally jog in the front, and then I always feel guilty that I'm holding him back. So luckily, like 15 seconds in, he went in front of me. And I'm very competitive, so I'm like, I'm not letting him leave me. So I did yesterday. I started and completed the Brad to 5K program, which meant that Brad jogged in front of me, and I jogged the entire 5K without stopping once because he was in front of me and he forced me to pace myself at a slower pace than I would have done and that way I never had to stop the jogging so Brad to 5 t little, 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 Brad to 5k program thumbs up so if you would like to do the Brad to 5k program let me know give me your address we'll send them there <laughs> it's a one day program yeah. 
So, but thank you, thank you, thank you sure. for that. And thank you for being willing to jog with me every day no and just for being the best support system. I do what I can. I love you. Love you more. So, what else? Do you have any NSBs? Um, I don't think so. Okay. Okay. Not so, much to report, really. There's not, yeah, there's not a lot to report. I'm trying to detox for me and stop eating pure crap um, because I'm supposed to be getting a fill next Tuesday mm -hmm. under fluoroscopy and I want to make sure that <coughs> between now and then I don't eat anything that I get stuck on so I'm not inflamed so that way I can get an accurate fill because I'm hungry all the time. Even today, you know, every two hours I was eating something and it was, you know. A small amount will get me satisfied, but it doesn't last me a long enough time. So, that is my frustration. Anything else from you? I think so. One thing that we're going to talk about next week is um, our goals for 2014. And I have to say, in getting ready for that, I looked at our video for oh, 2013. Yeah. And I guess we can talk about that now. Sure. Um, I'm. It wasn't our first video it was our second video I think that we set our goals right but it was just the, the video where we set our goals for 2013 and I was you know getting ready to watch it thinking yeah I probably failed I'm sure I set a numbers goal and I probably failed and I'm very pleasantly surprised I set um, a numbers goal of being 185 and I, and I did it so granted I set a that goal could have been a I could have set a harder goal but I did meet my goal and I'm very proud of that and Brad as, as he's told you he's met his two goals of running the 5k and getting in a size 40 pants so mm -hmm. we are we are doing good over the long haul even if I am eating my weight in chocolate currently but it's Christmas chocolate so it's okay that's it anything else I don't think so Okay, so we will get our video in on time next week. Hope you all have a wonderful holiday season. I hope you all got what you wanted from Santa Claus, even if you were naughty. Um, and that's it. We hope you have a great day. We hope you all are big losers, and we're sorry we're late this week. And by the time we get to you next week, it'll already be the New Year, so Happy New Year. No, it won't. Oh, it won't. Yes, it will. Wednesday is the New Year. Yeah, yeah. I'm an idiot. So Happy New Year to everyone. Be safe. I think it's all good. Yeah. Uh, this is called vacation break, okay? <laughs> so we've got a lot of jogging to do. All right. Okay, talk to you later, guys. Bye, everyone.